una mattina mi sono alzato Oh bella ciao, bella ciao, bella ciao, ciao, ciao Una mattina mi sono alzato e ho trovato l'invasore Un partigiano Italy is a beautiful country famous for food, wine, music, tourist places, and soccer. It has a diverse wine culture in the world. Regarded as the world's largest exporter of wines, there are 20 wine regions in Italy. These regions can represent every color in the rainbow. That means they have a wide variety in producing wines. Wine laws There are four categories. First is DOCG, Denomigiano di Origine Controllata e Garantita. This classification denotes the highest quality recognition for Italian wines. DOC, Denomigiano di Origine Controllata. Wines that fall under this category must be made in specified zones with some regulations. High GT, Indice Giano. The Geographica Typica, it is awarded to good quality table wines. The last, we know the Tavola, Italian table wines. Only criteria is that they must be produced somewhere in Italy. Some indigenous grapes from Italy, White, Moscato Bianco, Malvasia, Trebbiano, Pinot Grigio, Fiano, Red, Nebbiolo, Giangio Vese, Barbara, Egianico, Dolcito, Merlot. There are almost 20 wine regions as we know. The first region is Piemont, with the magic of icy cold Alps and warm Mediterranean influence. Piemont is situated in northwest of Italy and produces remarkable quality red wines like Barolo, Barbaresco, Gattinara, Dolcito, Nebbiolo di Alba. Barolo The wine of kings and the king of wines. Barolo wines hails from the village of Barolo of Piemont. This beautiful region is situated on the foothills of Alps in northwestern Italy. The wine of Barolo is made from Nebbiolo grapes which gives this wine a distinct flavor. Nebbiolo grape has a long history that dates back to 13th century. This was a cask wine till 19th century after which it was bottled in glass bottle. Modern Barolo is a dry, heavy in acidity, pale garnet color, more tannin and alcohol 14% ABV. It means was it sweet? Answer is yes. After 18th century, modern techniques were introduced to ferment Nebbiolo completely. The credit goes to Camillo Benso, a leader of Italian unification. The Barolo War. Traditionally, Barolo takes 10 years to soften and ready for consumption. It led to a kind of war in 1980 between old producers and new producers. Of course, new schools wanted to speed up fermentation and uh, other processes and old schools were opposing. Now don't worry, both products are almost matches. There is a documentary on to this war, Barolo Boys, the story of a revolution. You can watch it. Next, pairing. This robust wine may be paired with the strong foods like beef, veal, and truffles. Next is Barbaresco. Barbaresco wine comes from the Barbaresco commune situated near the town of Alba in Piemont. This area is warmer than neighboring Barolo, resulting in less tannin wine. The wines are grown on limestone soil, grape used, Nebbiolo. 12% alcohol by volume, Barbaresco wine may be less tannin but still plenty of 
acidity makes it more elegant than its counterpart. Pairing braised meat, risotto, porcini, mushroom and blue cheese. The next Gatinara with 12.5% ABV Gatinara red wine hold DOCG seal and is produced using Nebbiolo grapes and some other blended grapes. Dolcito produced using Dolcito grapes. It is a soft, fruity, gentle red wine. The next, some sparkling wine from Piemont region are Astio Spumante. Astio Spumante is a sparkling wine from the town of Asti and Alba. A DOCG wine made from Moscato Bianco grape, bit sweet and low in alcohol, maybe around 9%. Made from Charmet method. Next, Moscato di Asti, produced in the same region with same grape, but more sweet and less alcoholic, 5%, makes it a better dessert wine. The next region is Lombardy, situated in the middle of Italy. Lombardy, with cool continental climate, produces Francia Corta DOCG wine. Francia Corta, it's a fruity sparkling wine produced using Chardonnay, Pinot Noir and Pinot Blanc with 11.5% alcohol by volume is made from traditional method. The next reason is Alto Adigo Torrentino. It is situated in northeast of Italy, produces some good wines using Zaru's Tramin grapes. The next reason is Veneto. State of Veneto is situated in the northeast, famous for its tourist places like Venice, and produces a remarkable quality sparkling wine, Prosecco. Yes, Prosecco is a sparkling wine which is made from Glera grapes, comes in both dry and sweet form. Charmet method is used for making Prosecco. Now, Prosecco is getting popular these days. It's not just a Bellini cocktail ingredient anymore. Pairing. Yes, it can be paired with Parma ham for dry. And for sweet version, you can offer sweet souffle. The next reason is Friuli Venegia Giulia. It is situated in northeast, produces Picolet. It's a white desert wine made from picolet grapes and a Rufosco red wine which is made from Rufosco grapes. The next reason is Emilia Romagna. It is situated in central Italy, mountainous and poor river land produces Lambrusco. Lambrusco, it's a bright red sparkling wine comes in both sweet and dry it is made from lambrusco grapes and blend of many other grapes it is made from charmet or tank method alcohol by volume eight percent food pairing prosciutto ham and roasted turkey the next reason is umbria umbria is situated in the central italy it is a land of Monte Falco Sagarantino DOCG red wine, which is made from Sagarantino grapes. There is another red wine, which is Torgiano Reserva DOCG, that is made from Giangiovese and Sagarantino grapes. The next reason is La Marche. La Marche, maybe. One of the untouched wine regions. Wine making and viticulture is still progressing, but with a pace. It indicates that it may come as new Tuscany on the wine map. The next reason is Molise. Molise, it is situated in southern central Italy, produces some red and white wine. Uh, like La Marche, it is yet to come on the popular wine map. The next reason is Abruzzo. 
Abruzzo is situated in the east of Italy, produces Vercchio di Castelli di Jesse Diossi, which is produced using Verdicchio grapes. The next region is Tuscany. Tuscany is situated in the west central Italy and it is famous for art, architecture, food, music, and Chianti wine. Chianti wine making zone is situated between beautiful city of Florence and Siena. Maybe one of the best known popular wine of Italy, Chianti is made from Giangiovese grapes. This well structured tannin acidity wine is having wild herbs and cherry character as well. Alcohol by volume 12%. It comes into a straw basket which is called Fiasco. The next reason is Lazio. Lazio is situated on the west of Italy. It produces Frascati white wine made from Malvasia grapes. East, East, East. It's a sparkling wine which is made with white Trebbiano and Malvasia Bianco grapes having 11% alcohol by volume. The next reason is Campania. It is situated in the west south of Italy. This region is famous for spaghetti and some volcanic arc. Fiano di Avellino Diocesi. It's a white wine made from Fiano grapes with 11.5% alcohol by volume. Tarasi Diocesi. It's a red wine made from Aglia Nico grape with 12.5% ABV. There is one remarkable wine that is Lacrima Christi Tears of Christ which comes from this region only made from Verdeca and Coda di Volpe grapes. The next region is Calabria. Calabria is situated in extreme south of Italy. It is not as popular but produces some red and white wines. The next reason Basilicata. Basilicata it's a old region which is situated in south central Italy and produces Primitovo di Manduria red wine which is made from Primitovo grapes. There is one more red wine that is Angelianico del Vulture. It is produced from Angelia Nico grapes. Sicily. Island of Sicily is situated in the south Italy. This volcanic land is home of fortified wine Marsala DOCG, which is a dry and sweet wine made from blend of Grillo, Catarato, Injolia grapes. It's having 15 to 20 percent of alcohol by volume. The last Sardinia. This island is in west of Italy, produces some white wines, yet more to be discovered. That's all in today's video. Next is wines of Germany. Take care.